Hey guys, what's going on? Brenner and I are getting ready to install some TMR custom inserts into the um, door hinges of my 89 Islander over here. They're half doors and they're a little sticky every time I take them off and they're kind of a pain to try to get off and on. And uh, we're gonna fix the problem the right, right way, right Brenner? Yep. <laughs> so take the door off on your YJ. You gotta remove the door strap right here. Make sure the door doesn't swing around and hit your fender. Make sure you have one hand on it. Then hold the door by the bottom kind of pull up and wiggle it at the same time. You don't want to use anything to pry up on. It's like a two by four anything because you risk bending the hinges. So I'm just kind of working mine off. These things are just a bear. Oh, don't drop it. <laughs> So what I had to do on my YJ is the inserts right here, you could barely even tell there were some inserts in here. They wouldn't bang out with the um, supplied tool to tap them out with. Uh, they're really rusted in there. You could actually, they're so worn, you could barely even tell that they're in there. So I took like the heads off them. Uh, but they're in there. So I'm using a 7 16 drill bit to uh, get these out. Uh, what I did is that I measured um, the end of this against the butt end of the drill bit to make sure that it was the same size. You don't want to go bigger. Uh, you want to go a little bit smaller, if anything, or about the same size because you don't want to drill this hole too big. Um, so I'm just going real careful and I'm going to do these two and put these inserts in. Okay, so I finished going through this with the 7 16 and it took just about the entire sleeve out of there. It took a little while. Go slow. Um, if this is what you need to do, this is what I'm doing. You may not need to do this. You're, if you're lucky, your inserts will just tap right out. Uh, some of them are stepped from what I've heard. This one doesn't seem to be stepped. Uh, kind of went right through pretty easily. For me, the inserts didn't tap right out. Um, the tool was too big, too big for the hole. So I um, went this route with it. I mean, they had put anything, everything under the sun on these YJs. They really did. A lot of this stuff is different between years, and it's you guys that own them, you know. So this is what I'm doing. So I have a 2964th drill bit right here, and it's a smidgen bigger than the 716th that I just used. Uh, and it's pretty flush with the um, diameter of the insert that I received. So I'm gonna clean it up a little bit more, just a whisker, and these inserts should slide right in. So just a little, little bit is all I needed for this insert uh, to fit tightly. It fits real tight, it's real snug. So I'm going to gently tap this down into the um, hinge. And um, before I do that, I'm going to let this cool down a little bit because it is a little warm. You don't want to get these heated up. And I'm going to go down around to the other three. And it's going to be a pain, but this is the road that I need to take with this Jeep with this. Okay, so in the kit, they give you four of these plastic inserts, um, two per side. And then they give you this removal tool to remove the... Um, metal liner that's in there. I mean, this thing has been in there for about 30 years. You can barely see it. It looks like it's part of the hinge. It's so worn. Um, this tool didn't work on my hinge because it's too, it's supposed to go from the bottom up. And if this is going to work on a later year YJ, um, mask off this area with masking tape so you don't hit it with the hammer and nick it up. But go from the bottom and tap it with a hammer and kind of tap out your hinge liner. I'm going to insert the bottom one. And now I'm pushed right into place. It didn't need to tap it at all. And I'm gonna put my door on. So I've got my hinge liners installed. And it makes it a little easier to remove the doors. And then put them back on again. Mine just slides right into place. Thanks for watching the video. If you guys have any questions, leave a comment. Don't forget to like the video if you liked it and subscribe to the channel. Thanks for watching.